and the country is Sierra Leone and then the way I do my research is whatever catches my eye like a tribal traditional makeup or like a print or something that speaks to me and then I represent it on my face so today I found a specific print that is native to Sierra Leone and I grew up in Africa and I didn't even know that print existed and it's called Bati. So beautiful. You guys know I love colors and that spoke to my soul so I am going to recreate it on my eyes. Hopefully I do it justice. So here we go. So the whitest base that you can find is by NYX. Well, that I can find is by NYX or what's in my budget. <laughs> it's by NYX and it is... SB01. I tell you guys all the time, this is milk in a jar. Um, next, I'm going to be adding color to my lid, and I am, I don't want fallouts, so I'm going to be using this pink right here. So, the more and more I look at this this look like what's forming I want it to be on the bottom as well like I just have this concept in my head I always tell you guys I have no clue what I'm doing until I start doing it and it's just it flows out of me so now for the next color I'm gonna be using this blue right here next for a little bit of shimmer I am gonna be using my Too Shy Super Shock Press Pigment by ColourPop. Going into my Creative Me number one palette by Coastal Scents. I know y'all, that's how old I am. <laughs> I'm gonna be using this beautiful purple right here. Using my NYX Vivid Halo, this beautiful yellow right here. All right, so I thought about it. I think I should go ahead and do my foundation and then outline the leaf because I feel like if I do the leaf and then do my foundation I might erase some of the leaf you get what I mean all right keep your fingers crossed here we go I'm gonna be using my matte uh, and poreless this is by Maybelline and it is the fit me 330 toffee caramel okay now I can do the leaf. Now I'm gonna be using my NYX Vivid Brights, the one that I said earlier. vision for it and for that I'm gonna be using and for that I'm gonna be using my Trader Joe's organic virgin coconut oil so it's like that using my freedom pro conceal and correct palette so this color right here I'm gonna be using my Wet n Wild. This is their coverall collection and the color is tan. I'm gonna be using that to set it. I'm completely satisfied with how this is turning out. I am going to be using my Fenty Beauty and this is, hold on, this Hottie Alert. Down to highlight, you guys know I am freaking out since I got this um, present. Uh, from the Miza. Thanks, the Miza. It is How Many Carrots by Fenty. I am totally obsessed with this. Completely obsessed with this. It's so smooth. I literally just have to use my finger and add the highlight. And for lips today, I'm going to be using 17. This is a brand uh, from the UK. 
and it's their Stay Pout collection, and the color is Make an Entrance. Like if I was a tribal girl, that's exactly what I would want to do, okay? It's better than I envisioned it, so I'm pretty stoked. Like, if you're going to a festival, I know things are canceled in 2020, but you can still be inspired in 2021. So this is the look for 2021 if you're going to Coachella. Until next time, guys. Bye.